I'll share the sauce with y'all. Like, I'm, I'm not even about hiding it. Oh, please join my team. If you don't join my team, I'm not going to give you a sauce. That, it don't matter to me. Like, I'll share it with you. But... Hey guys, how's it going? It's your girl DJ and you are back trading with DJ. Today I got a treat for you. I got a new indicator that I want to introduce you guys to. Maybe some of you know it, maybe you don't, but I just wanted to like, you know, share it with you guys because I've been seeing some results with it. Um, but it's been lit. And I kind of like this, you know, not showing my face. But I feel like I have a deeper connection with you guys when my face is right on the screen. So you can feel me talking to you. In, in guiding you so um, you guys let me know what you think so here, here here's what i do right first um definitely gotta mark up that zones so here's what i've been using i've been using hike and ashi candles um and i see it's pretty good like i i i'll share the sauce with y'all like i'm i'm not even about hiding it oh please join my team if you don't join my team i'm not gonna give you a sauce that it don't matter to me like i'll share it with you but you still need to be in a team for you to really see. Um, there's people that say you don't need to be. Quite honestly, you, you, you. If you're the type of person that can learn on your own, and and be okay with years. And I kind of like this, you know, not showing my face. But I feel like I have a deeper connection with you guys when my face is right on the screen, so you can feel me talking to you, and and guiding you. So um, you guys, let me know what you think. So here, here, here's what I do, right? first um definitely gotta mark up that zones so here's what i've been using i've been using hike and ashi candles um and i see it's pretty good like i i i'll share the sauce with y'all like i'm i'm not even about hiding it oh please join my team if you don't join my team i'm not gonna give you a sauce that it don't matter to me like i'll share it with you but you still need to be in a team for you to really see um there's people that say you don't need to be quite honestly you 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 if you're the type of person that can learn on your own and, and be okay with years of years of years of learning on your own trial and error, that's okay. But if you're one person that, that was like me that said, you know what, I'd rather save myself some time, energy, and money, I'm going to join a team because two is better than one, and I can't teach myself something I don't know. So, yeah, you don't hear me talk about it all the time because I believe in it because that's what worked out for me. I'm, I'm, I can only recommend you what, what I did. In, in what I saw results with. I'm not gonna tell you to do something I, that was it, that, that didn't work, All right? So notice the correlation here. Notice years of years of years of learning on your own trial and error, that's okay. But if you're one person that, that was like me that said, you know what, I'd rather save myself some time, energy and money, I'm gonna join a team because two is better than one and I can't teach myself something I don't know. So yeah. You don't hear me talk about it all the time because I believe in it because that's what worked out for me. I'm, I'm, I can only recommend you what, what I did and, and what I saw results with. I'm not going to tell you to do something I, that was it, that, that didn't work. All right, so notice the correlation here. Notice, um, notice what the market's done, you know, over time, what it's, what it's done. So you can see, I'm actually expecting for the market to possibly go above this and then do another pullback around this area up here right or higher or higher so let's see i could be wrong this isn't about um being perfect because i don't make the market i, I simply understand how the market move and then i try to keep up with it you gotta, you gotta be complicating this for no reason some people complicated but basically i've been using the parabolic sar and it's pretty simple to use right but before i do that i always try to you know do my signature touches you know the the signature um support and resistance touches i'm on a five five minute time frame and also um when you're when you're marking up on on trading view make sure it's the time frame that you're on in trading view is the same time frame as your your um broker because some people would be like oh my god the candles look different what's going on well yeah you're on two different time frames on each chart so of course it's going to look different so that's something some people don't know or trying to figure out on their own and i just you know break it down for you so um 
there's that. So here's what I'm, 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 I'm about to do here. I'm gonna show you how to find confirmations with just zones, right? So so I'm gonna expect for the market to actually um, make its way down after that ter third touch. Uh, and then I'm gonna leave this up, up here so you guys can see. Cause sometimes when I do my markups and I, I'm able to like, you know, put it right on to where I, I predict that the market's gonna do. Some people be like, there's no way. How did you know exactly where it's gonna be? How, I don't know, don't ask me, that. how do I answer that question? I don't know. I just understand like, I've, I've done this so much. That's why I say you don't need to be trading all these different. Look, you'll see a lot of different pairs in my uh, in my charts. That's because I, be, I, I do videos and I also, I'm doing one-on-ones with people all the time. So. I have to de demonstrate with them showing different, 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 um, different pairs, but I don't trade all of these pairs. Nope, 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 nope. I don't, I do not. But, um, oh, it actually went above. It actually went above. Let me see how long I can hold it for it to, um, you know, do the move so that y'all can see. It might not go as low. It might, it might go high like this. And then it'll pull down. May not go as low. So let's see here. Right, boom. Let's see, it'll make it happen here. Right, let me change this color. Oh, I had a weird dream last night. Well, I don't really remember it. I just know it was weird. So, um, gotta hit the Bible. Cause the devil ain't gonna take control of me. I'm a child of God, y'all. I'm a Christian. So for all the Christians watching this, it's good stuff. Stay deeply rooted in Christ. All right. <clears throat> so, if you don't see it yet, I don't know what to tell you. I'll probably um, bring this up a little higher. Okay, this is five minutes. So this is my markup. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've been behind the screen for a little while, so my eyes, I actually woke up in the middle of the night because this is the best time that I could actually do markups since I'm so busy during the day. But, um, you guys were able to see this, right? So it went above. If I was trading right now, I'd definitely um, be buying, you know, and this is a five minute candle. It actually has two more minutes left, which tells me the market's gonna, you know, close on a bullish side. So that means I'd be buying and, and um, clearing some trades right about now. Um, it's shooting, right? but I did my trading earlier. And to be quite honest, guys, um, I, I don't feel like trading. <laughs> I don't feel like going in, in my account right now. So some days you'll feel like that. It's okay. I mean, every stage is on, everybody's different. But if I don't have the energy for it, I, I ain't gonna go in there. Cause I already know my mind is not in the game. I'm not going to force my, my body to do something that my mind is not in the game for. So I got to get myself together and find the energy because I am really tired. You know, don't trade while you're tired because your mind's not going to be in the game. And then you're just going to give the banks, you know, what they want, which is your money. So now for the SAR, you're probably like, okay, DJ, we get it. What are you trying to say? All right, all right, here we go. So with the parabolic SAR, um, let me find it. Um, I'm gonna show y'all the, the settings that I got. A little color change, defaulted. Um, <clears throat> that's what I got going on. Nothing big, nothing serious. But basically, when you see the 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 SAR, like the the little stars at the bottom, that means the market is on the rise. Notice something here. Notice even though it created some red candles here, it's still 
the can the the stars are still at the bottom which indicates that it's still going up right don't let those candles here fool you into thinking it's actually going down now because unless it actually pulled down to let's say um to create a new low which it didn't do you you have no business sitting here selling that's why i be telling people you you don't have to try to catch you know the little in between chump change when you can catch the big bucks right don't 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 think you're missing out but basically when the when the stars are at the bottom you can see that it's going up up and i add my bollinger bands in there for perfect perfect um you know confirmation so that's a lot of colors for you right i know i like to keep it simple so i might get rid of the colors a little uh, let's make it a little less transparent oh that's so much better guys notice what's happening this is a, a perfect buy if you are buying, if you bought right above that resistance level, you would definitely um, have cleared already, right? So here we got, notice whenever it goes down, the parabolic SAR is at, at the top, right? It's at the top. And you'll know that it's going to be, that it's going to like switch directions because you it starts forming. It starts, it starts with one. Once you see there's one up there or one at the bottom, you already know, okay, boom there's a possibility that this is gonna keep going in this direction. Don't just go based off of one, cause sometimes there'll be one can one parabolic uh, little star up there and it actually doesn't um, go the other way. It's like a fake out. So that really, that, that happens, but when it does, you gotta catch it or else you won't be in it. So, you know, it's gonna be a, a you know, a silent song. you will um yeah but but that's basically it honestly it's pretty simple it's not complicated because i've been watching i've been using it a little bit more before i introduced it to you guys but as you can see the bollinger bands and um the, the correlation right so i got my vertical lines and i got my um rectangles and then i have my bollinger uh well i have the parabolic sar and I have my arrows. So I got multiple ways to conf to get confirmation, you know, to, to keep keep um keep winning off of this thing. So yeah, let me know if it makes sense. So not only do we have the arrows letting us know, okay, this is the possible next move that's happening, and we got the the Bollinger Bands, look, look how the candles are scraping on the blue line right here in this area. If that ain't telling you it's on the upside, I don't know what else is, right? Look how far it is away from that um, moving average. That's that red line right here in the middle. There's, a, there's another, uh, uh, there's another strategy I actually, I'm going to introduce you guys to, and it's going to make a lot of sense. It's pretty simple as well. But um yeah, I, I, I learn a lot. I spend a lot of time learning this stuff so that I can, you know, speak the language fluently and not have to fake it. Because there's a lot of fakers out here, guys. A lot of people that fake it. Um, it's a lot of craziness. You just got to, once you understand what you're doing, you can differentiate between real and fake, you know, so you don't have to fall into stuff you shouldn't be falling into. But I do recommend if you... um if you are trading and you're and you're still a little bit if you 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 got to do some self development too got to read you got to learn how to control yourself you got to learn how to you know start and stop when when needs be you got to learn how to um, you know control yourself in the market some people psh, lord knows i mean i ain't, i'm just going to be real with y'all i'm one of those people um sometimes it's like dang 
you know, I, I was right on. I could really be working, milking it right now, but nah, I made what I need to make for the day. I'm good. Shut the laptop down and stop before you give the money back to the market. Right. I think I'm going to try to hold it so you guys can see um, that pullback that happens. It may not happen above the arrow. It may not happen below, but it, it'll happen in that area somewhere. Um, right. So let's let's get it. Uh, that's four confirmations, actually. So let me write that down. Confirmation one. You, you know you got to have multiple confirmations. And this is for um, binary options. One, down arrows. Down arrows correlation. Two, Bollinger bands. Above, moving average. This is for a buy. Confirmations for a buy. And then we got three parabolic. Parabolic S A R below. And then we got four. Break above resistance. Boom, ba bam. There it is, guys. Don't say I ain't share the sauce with y'all, right? Like I said in that uh, um, in the previous video, people be like, "Well, why you? Why we gotta join your team if you already telling us if you giving? If I could just learn for you for free and not have to pay? You're not paying me to join my team. <laughs> You're not paying me." You're, you're using the platform, you're paying the platform that I use, that I pay as well, right? I pay, people don't understand that I pay too, because I got to continue to have access to the information, right? Because I'm, I'm getting results, so I'm going to continue to pay for it. I pay as well, right? I didn't create the platform, I just leverage it to help other people as well. So if you want to get the results that I've gotten, you, you won't have to stop being cheap, you know, stop focusing on a couple hundred dollars it's not going in my pockets i'm doing this I, I honestly there's people that's killing it in the markets and they're not sharing it with nobody they're keeping all the sauce to themselves but the fact that i'm willing and open to just put this out there that should tell you about a lot about my character right and i'm not big on talking about myself i don't do that but i just want y'all to understand like it, 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 it's 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 good stuff right i wouldn't talk you know um good about something if it doesn't work i'm not that type of person so confirmations for a buy down errors correlation boom boom then we got bollinger bands above moving average right boom boom it's gonna start coming away from me i want y'all to see it um just when it's going down i'm gonna keep holding it and then we got um parabolic sar that's below Okay, boom, boom. Then we got the break above resistance. Boom, boom. It's about to start pulling back, right? That retest, break and retest. So we're going to wait for that recess before I go ahead and uh, close this out for y'all. So this is all on the five minute time frame. If you are trading binary, um, I do recommend trying five minutes or three minutes or whatever it is, whatever works for you, to be honest. You know, it's up to you. It's really up to you. Because I could tell you to do something that doesn't work for you. That's fine. Right? Just find what works. When I, when I say this to people, people just be like, what do you mean by that? Find what works. When, when, okay. If you're doing something and, it, and you're getting results from it, that, that means it works. So whatever you're doing that you get results from, stick to it. Don't change it just because DJ told you, oh, go ahead and mark up on five minutes. Don't change it because I told you, oh, do it on three minutes. If it works for you doing it on 
on um one minute. <laughs> I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend that, but if if that's what works for you, I mean it's not that I wouldn't recommend it. It's just like I mean that because I'm not one of those people that say, oh, if you don't trade on this time frame, you're not gonna be successful. Yeah, nah. It's a big market. It's a big market, guys. It's 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 really um we don't make the market we just i tell people all the time like if i if i do a markup and it doesn't go my way I'm like, okay big whoop why didn't it go my way why didn't it go how i expected it to go right try to learn from the mistakes instead of sitting here worrying about you know things you can't control you can't control the market not control the market but um i started reading this book guys it's called 365 the uh, days devotional a little god time for a woman woman um so um i gotta take it more seriously because basically each day it gives you a, a devotion to, to you know, read it's 365 days I bought it last month and to be honest with you guys, I haven't been in there as much as I should have, but I know it would help if I did, because there's some good stuff in there. But um, yeah, just rambling on, trying to pass the time so that y'all could see this move. Mm -hmm. Oh, here's another thing. You see how this move happened? and the red candles weren't below the red the, the moving average they weren't they weren't below the red line that's also telling you that the market is not actually gonna keep going down because remember we 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 buy once it's once it's above and it's scraping against the blue line that's confirmation and then once it's below and it's scraping like this area here how it was scraping okay Those candles were big, right? Those were big, pretty big bearish bars. But in this instance, and it 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 gave you it. The, here's a big difference between those two. This big move happened from consolidation, right? It happened from consolidation, but this did did not. This move did not. You get what I'm saying? So, do you guys notice the bearish, the bearish bar forming? I don't know. I don't know how I'm right on. I just know it. I just know it. You study the, the stuff enough. You study the grades and you become greater. Thanks to the I Am Academy. Um, you know been able to do this so i might let it just touch the resistance level and then close this out but yeah so this didn't come from a consolidation so i you don't know for sure that it'll happen that it'll actually um make a big move so you'd rather be safe and sorry and stay out of it until you see the candle is actually below if you see it's above still that means it's gonna keep going up <laughs> you know what i'm saying so if you see the bearish bars are still above that moving average, it's gonna keep going up. Mm. Right. That means it's not gonna go back down to this level here. Right. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Break above retest, and then it's gonna go up. I love this. I'm telling you, the market is pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. Mm -mm -mm. Right? But you guys, you guys seen it? Now I can close it out. I just wanted to make sure y'all see it before I close it out because I'm not going to post like a after picture along with this video. I'm just going to um, put it out um, back to back. So uh, there you have it. Four confirmations for a buy. You know, correlation, 
Will and your bands of love moving average very well. Yes, they are. Candles. Break above resistance. And notice the SARs are still at the bottom. So it's not saying you're selling, even though there's a red candle here. It's not saying, oh, we're about to sell. We're about to drop. Unless it does that, then you know for sure it's going to keep going up. All right. All right. Hope this made sense for you. Right, let's clear the screen so you can see what's happening here. Right, got all the markup. You're able to see. Right, look at the parabola. Yes, they are at the bottom. Right, look at the correlation. All right, red candles, red candles, big drops. This one, I wouldn't really count it because it was a fake out. But this actually been on the on the uptrend. All right, so let's put them back in. See that? Perfect. Stay right within the zone that we predicted. Go back to the beginning of this video. Look what the chart looked like, and then come back here and, and look what it what it looks like right. yeah i'm tired so i'm gonna go catch a little more sleep before i start my day tomorrow well it's already <laughs> see that's how you know i'm tired the, like tomorrow already started because it's currently five in the morning for me right it's five in the morning i'm about to be six eastern time you know i care about you guys so i, I i'm sacrificing my sleep I love me some sleep, honey. Um, but no, nah, it really doesn't matter to me because I'll sleep when I get wealthy. I'll sleep on the bands <laughs> when I get wealthy. I'll sleep in my mansion, in my three-car garage mansion, along with my uh, Bugatti and my Maserati <laughs> and my Audi, all the Ds. <laughs> I'm such a trip, guys. You see how this is how I talk when, when I'm drowsy. So don't take me seriously, but um, yeah, my, my Maserati, my Audi, my Bugatti. <laughs> That's too funny. All right, y'all. Let me um put this back on. Now I, I'm having the urge to let it, you know, go back up, <laughs> and so you guys can catch it. But you can catch that on your own time. Well, you guys can already see what I was trying to explain to you. So this is pretty simple, right? You saw what I started with. You saw what I added to it. Um, I, lately, I've been tra trading the EuroCAD. I love it. It's been doing me a, you know, solid. So I love it. I know I keep saying I'm done and I keep talking some more. But, um, But that's it um, until, the, until the next video. Y'all, we really got to get to 10K. So let's push. If you're watching this and you didn't subscribe, make sure that you subscribe. You don't miss out on some good information not subscribing now, right? That's y'all way of paying me back with a subscription for all the good value that I put out here for y'all, right? So uh, stay blessed and let's continue to be great. Y'all have a good one.